Hi guys, happy Sunday. It's Christina back from Subscribe to Life. Thank you for subscribing and so excited to share another Lifesaver how-to with you. Well, today I am actually going to share a little bit about my tea life. I really like tea. Right behind me is my tea station, which I always um, have on hand for myself. I actually switch up between coffee and tea during a given week. More on the coffee, less on the tea lately, um, but usually I'll do a, at least one or two days of tea um, because I just love the process of tea. Uh, and so I have tea here, but there's a reason why I'm highlighting tea today. Today we're actually going to talk about a study that came out that talks about um, the Omicron variant. Uh, so you all know as COVID uh, and SARS is another variant of that. Um, a study came out by Japanese researchers and I will post a couple pictures of it here so you can see. Um, and the study came out and it said that, hmm, if you consume black or green tea, um, you can significantly reduce your um, ability to uh, get rid, or I'm sorry, you, you can significantly reduce um, having the Omicron variant or SARS variant of COVID-19 in your system. Um, it increases your uh, gastrointestinal system um, and also helps your body fight off um, a lot easier. Um, now, I originally saw this article, I read a lot, so you'll see a picture of me here. I read um, the newspaper often. It's been a new thing of mine um, to try and get my news from the source. Uh, so if those of you that do comment below, what do you think about reading newspapers? Because it's a new thing for me. I love it. I know it's been around for like decades, but hey. Um, more like centuries. Um, but anyway, so I read it there and um, it was an excellent, excellent article. I, I This is not a, um, a sponsored video, but if you guys um, are interested in truth and reporting, there is a um, newspaper that I subscribe to called Epic Times. They are very central in their reporting. Um, and uh, I tend to like them because they keep things central. Well, this was on the mind and style uh, page um, that talked about the study that came out. And so there was there, then I went online and I researched some more and I have a couple pictures here that you can see of um, the actual article PDF uh, from the research itself, which I thought was really interesting. So just to break it down, which I thought was interesting, they had um, seven participants. Some people ate candies that were infused with black and green tea, and some people drank actual hot black or green tea. And they found out all kinds of things. One of them was depending on what your region is, um, if you're in a hot climate, um, that would basically determine if you drink black or green tea, which one of those would help you for the Omicron or SARS variants for COVID-19 would help your body fight it. So that was interesting. Um, and also if you did, um, if you infused, did the candy infusions, you uh, have about five or 10 minutes that it's supposed to help your body. So that one you would need to do more of um, if you chose to do that. I thought that was interesting. Obviously this is studies that are continuing to go. This was a study that came out in January of this year, um, but still pretty cool. And we're in that season where it's like, you gotta do something. I honestly, if I open my fridge now, you guys would see lemons, oranges. I would probably have a whole bottle of zinc if I could right now. I mean, I'm trying to, got honey, local honey. There's these little spots off the street where um, you can buy from some of the local farmers. I am trying to make sure I am not getting sick this year. So if you're like that, you're like me, and it always comes around that year, you have either bad allergies or you just know you're gonna get sick um, if you don't take care of yourself, this might be an interesting study. So you wanna keep yourself warm. Usually in the cold months, if you're in a cold region, people usually go for hot chocolate or tea or coffee. Maybe you wanna go for that tea. Maybe you want to go for that green. Maybe you want to go for that black. I mean, hey, might be interesting, right? So um, just throwing that out there. Another thing too, if uh, the study said as well, and this is the one if you, again, if you um, are, have a chance to read either the um, Epic Times newspaper article or go to the actual PDF of the study from the Japanese researchers, 
it said that you can actually still get the same effects from the hot black or green tea in bottled tea, like from the store, like, like a facility bottled it. And as long as it has black or green tea in it, you know, it doesn't have all those fillers. Um, it just, you'll see on the label, it says like black or green tea, and then it might say filtered water or something like that. Those are just as legitimate for giving you the effects. Isn't that interesting? Anyway, tell me what you guys think. I thought this was a good study. Everyone seemed to um, like, put some thumbs up for the study that I talked about last time on brain health. Um, I love doing these because I love finding out about new things and I'm all about nature and being your best self on this channel because I believe life happens through you, not to you. And so put that black or green tea in your system so you got some life in you, okay? That was what seems like is the, is the thing the Japanese researchers are telling us. So anyway, I will see you guys Tuesday for another lifesaver moment. And uh, you guys have an awesome, awesome Sunday. Bye-bye now.